It was a great night for baseball in Erie tonight as the Seawolves got the chance to compete in their first playoff game since 2013. It's new at 10 o'clock. Matt Mathias was at UPMC Park as fans arrived and has the latest about not only what this game means to them, but also the support they have shown the team over the years. Matt. That's right, Jen. The Seawolves were victorious tonight with the final score being 9-3. to They also broke the record for playoff attendance in ball club history with over 4,700 people at UPMC Park. It's the first time that the Erie Seawolves have played in the minor league playoffs since 2013, and fans couldn't be more excited about their team. I've been waiting a long time, and uh, the, you couldn't ask for a better, better night to be down here for a playoff game. And... It's, it's what I've been waiting for for forever, I guess. Brookhauser says the city has come out in full force for the game, and he hopes that they'll come out again like this during the regular season next year to support the team. One fan tells us a big draw for coming and supporting this team is how personable the players are with fans, and the work that they do in our community makes it feel like family. It's a good quality group of human beings in the clubhouse, and that's stuff you can't teach. And and sometimes you don't always have that in a, in a baseball clubhouse. And we have you know 30 really good guys down there, uh, and and it makes our jobs easier when you, when you come to work every day and work with good quality human beings, and that's what all of our players are, uh, that, that makes our lives very easy. The atmosphere was great at the ballpark as local fans began to flood through the entrances of UPMC Park around 5.30. The Seawolf fan base has been immensely loyal over the years, and this playoff game is being seen by some as the reward for their support of the franchise over the years. We spoke to a Seawolf fan that's been coming to games for 17 years, and she tells us why she loves the team so much. The staff is amazing. They will do anything to make you happy here. The players, they've, they're so friendly. They're so friendly. And I get to sit with a lot of the players' families. It's, it's like an extra family for me, second family. And if the Seawolves win this three-game series? Oh, no doubt about it. I will be here with bells on, and I'll be here early. Stay tuned for more coverage of the Seawolves game with our very own Fox 66 sports team, who will have highlights of the contest later in the broadcast. Jan